Hey guys, welcome back to another video. Today, we're going to be reviewing the 2019 Lamborghini Urus inside of Pembroke Pines. I'm here joined by uh, Rob, and we're going to be reviewing this amazing car. Now, he's doing some funky feet thingy over there, and yeah, but this car is inside of the Supercar Game Pass for 200 wait, is that, yeah, 200 $22,004. I don't know why they had the four at the end. It could have just been $222,000, but no, you need that extra $4. Make sure you have it. But uh, yeah, let's just get into this review. But before we get into this review, because um, I'm stupid and I forget to say, there's a uh, limited hype of merch available on the Roblox group one week only. You know, pretty cool, pretty nice. It's on my, it's on my body right now. You can probably see it. Uh, and uh, yeah, let's get into this review, Rob. So um, looking oh. at the car, it looks pretty nice. Uh, I like it. What do you, what do you, what do you, what do you think about it? I kind of like it. Yeah, the I, I've of seen the Lamborghini. See, of course, you see me, I'm broke. I'm with 26000 dollars Yeah, I saw the Lamborghini years in real life, like, not even that long ago, and then these things are actually really, really nice. The game really detailed the car really nicely, but let's get into the car, and let's listen to the startup. Ooh, I like that. They, mm. they. They really, they really did a nice little start up there. Let's do the blinker test though. Um, and you can barely notice the blinkers. Uh, they're they're actually right down there. But the design of the blinkers are quite nice. I also like the little mirror blinker, and then the back. Uh, I do like the design in the back as well. That's all right. But let's do the uh, daylight running, daytime running lights. These look pretty aggressive. Look pretty mean. We turn the headlights on. Now they look even meaner. <laughs> but uh, let's do the rev <laughs> test now. It spits flames and it sounds so nice. I like it. It's so it's so nice. What do you think about this car so far? It's awesome. Yeah. That's all I'm gonna say. It's awesome. Yeah, it's amazing. But let's get onto the street here. Let's do the top speed test. And man, this car's acceleration is through the roof. It's already at 130, and we barely got off the line there. But will it be able to hit top speed before we hit the uh, brake test sign? No, it does not. It's 190 is its top speed. Let's do the brake test starting now. Starting from that signal light right back there. 190, almost 200 miles an hour. We got some decent braking. I like the braking it's done. Not that bad. Really nice. Let's do the turn test now. Let's go over to the uh, turn test location. And uh, let's take our first turn in the turn test. Hopefully I don't fail like every other turn test. Oh, oh, the car slid a little bit. I don't know if that was my my, my fault or not, but the car did slide a little bit. Let's do another turn. Okay, car didn't slide that much in it. The car is doing sort of good here. Oh, the back end wants to slide out. But overall, the car is not that bad at turning. It's actually really nice. It grips to the uh, street quite nicely around that last turn. So, like, maybe no braking and, like, all turn is what you need to do in this car. Yeah, it just grips really nicely. When you brake, it kind of slides. But overall, I rate this car a 9 out of 10. What do you rate this car, Rob? Same one. Same thing. Same one. Yeah, same thing. It's really nice. It's really cool. It's in the Supercar Game Pass, if you guys forgot. And, uh, yeah. Hope you guys enjoyed today's review. If you did, leave a like, subscribe, comment down below. And, Rob, do you have anything to say before we end off this video? Uh, Rob? Mm. Uh, uh, no, <laughs> I don't. <laughs> All right, I'll see you guys in the next one. Goodbye.